Good morning, good morning or good afternoon, depending on where you are today. Um, it's Mike Gabre back again. Uh, it's been a little bit since I made my last video, so I figured I'd get one out. And <laughs> I know I've said this before, but I will attempt to make more videos. It's very, it's just very inconvenient to try and record uh, things that I think are important at the time I'm doing them. Um, so I'm, I hope you understand that. But for me to sit like this and go back and reflect over it, or that definitely I can do and I will do more often. And of course, I'll try to do better at taking the camera with me when I'm actually out in the field or in the closing room or doing specific things. Okay, so for starters, let me start by by saying something I've said in previous videos that <clears throat> this is I'm not I'm not a real estate guy. I don't consider myself to be a real estate guy. I don't consider myself to be a real estate uh, expert. I don't. Um, and I'm not saying that as a disclaimer. That's just, that's how I feel about this. I, I do know real estate and I I know how to make money in real estate, but um, that is not my main thing. So um, this video, I'm going to show you guys how I made a pretty decent amount of money on one transaction, one real estate transaction. If you follow any of these videos, I did post one a while back and it was a while, but it was last year, but I posted a video about a land transaction, meaning I bought a piece of land and I sold that piece of land and I made $50,000, I think was the profit on that one. Um, but I did a similar thing. I've done that a few times, but this particular one is, I'm showing you this video because I just sold it this month and I will show you the document where I bought it, the document where I sold it, and you'll know how much money I made on it. You'll be able to see how much money I made on it. I'm going to show you the paperwork. Um, before I do that, I'm just I'm going to go into this to, to tell you guys that none of this would be possible if I don't put in the mental work, the spiritual work, and fix my paradigm. If I don't do that, I'm not making money in real estate. I'm not making nearly as much as I do and may not make any. So I've made videos in the past and... It's very important to me that you guys are catching this. I'm just, I'm not really beating it down, but you guys need to catch that spirituality, that mental work, that paradigm, that knowing yourself are the most important things. I, I do know real estate and I help people with it. If you have a question about it, I will help you with it. I'll answer your questions, which I've done. And I've, um, I'll help people if, if they want to get started. I'll give them what I think about it, but that's not the most important thing. The most important thing is what I just mentioned. If you're not right within, you cannot be right without. You're trying to jump a step when you you may not know internally things that are blocking your own good. You've got to be able to remove the blocks in life. If you don't, there's a million people on YouTube telling you that. You have to get your paradigm right. You have to get the blocks out of the way. You have to be spiritually in line. You have to be mentally in line to get physical success. The outside is just a reflection of what's on the inside. So if you're trying to change the outside, but you're not addressing the inside, you're just, you're going through motions. You're not going to get there. Okay. So you, you got to, you got to address that. Um, the reason why I'm showing you guys my real estate stuff is when I started and, I, and we are going to get to it, um, to these numbers, but the reason why I'm showing you that is because when I first started studying this, I just was not interested in people who were teaching me the mental aspect of life uh, or the internal aspect of life, but they didn't have anything on the, they didn't have anything material to show for it. They didn't have any money to show for it. Like in my mind, you have to, you have to be able to financially enjoy your life. If you're, they go hand in hand. If you're only spiritual, but you're, or only mental and you're not, making money or enjoying life or being able to afford the things you want. I'm not interested in that. The other way around as well. If you're only making money, but you're doing it as a result, as a result of your paradigm is geared toward money. Maybe you saw your parents make a lot of money and that's just ingrained in you, but you have no spirituality. You have no, you don't really know yourself. 
then I'm not interested in that either. I think it's, you got to be the total package here. So, and that's what I'm more interested in. And if you have that right, whether it's real estate or whatever you decide to do, you'll be successful if you address it that way. So, and I'll make more videos on that, but let's get to the money here, which I think is probably at this point more interesting to, to you guys. But here we go. So this is, it's called a settlement statement. It's just a document that shows a, a real estate transaction. And I highlighted at the top, you can see my name there. It's not a great copy, but you can see my name here. And then you can see the date that I bought it, which is June of 2019. And then I'm going to go to the bottom and I'm going to show you guys what I bought this for. Okay, let's see if we can zoom in a little bit better than that. Okay, so you can see the money there. 28600 and some odd dollars is what I bought this property for. That's what it cost me. Almost 29000 but twenty eight six. All right, and it's just a piece of land. There's nothing on it. There's no house on there. I didn't have to do any work. I didn't have to tear anything down. And then here, this is the document from me selling the land. And again, you can see my name. Let me point it out to you in case you can't. Right there. And I did do a 10... That the reason all that stuff is in front of my name is I did a 1031 exchange. If you're not familiar with that, that's a whole nother video, but it is something that's done in real estate when, um, to roll money from one property to the next. But I sold this property for $100,000. So I bought it for $28,600 and I sold it for $100,000. And you can see all the fees. And there at the bottom is highlighted, that's my net from this transaction, $90,000. 862 looks like dollars. It's backwards to me, but you guys can see it. So 90,000 was my net, 90,800. So I bought the property for 28,600 and then I sold the property and netted $90,800. So that's that's a profit of about $62,000. So I made $62,000 on this property. I just bought it. I mowed it a couple times. Literally, I probably mowed it three or four times. I didn't mow it myself. I had somebody mow it, um, but a few times, and that was it. There's there's nothing fancy about it. There's nothing special. I didn't go out there and make the land more appealing. I just bought it and then I sold it, and, and then obviously you saw how much I made doing that. So, and this is not the first time I've done that. I've done that several times. I've made another video doing it. I don't make a video on every single property that I that I do, but. Um, this one I wanted to just to show you guys what is possible when um, when you remove the blocks. I could not have done this five years ago. I had way too many blocks. I had way my paradigm was way off. Um, eight years ago, I didn't even know what a paradigm was. So my life really started changing when I started researching the right things and fixing the right things. When I knew what a paradigm was and how to address it, and how to attack it. When I had tools and exercises to get my mentality right, to get my paradigm right, to remove blocks, that's when life took off for me. That's when I started making more money in real estate and, and just being as successful as I am in it. Um, so I want you guys to know that and I want you guys to really look at these videos as more internal work, spiritual work. Um, real estate is just a vehicle to get me to where I can be financially free and I can have my time freedom. That's that's really the only things that are important to me. And that's why I do real estate is to achieve financial and time freedom. And I don't know what's important to you, but I do know that I can help you with it. I do know that I've learned enough over the years to help you be successful in whatever it is you do, because I know now how to fix people or fix problems from inside out. So ultimately I'll get to videos where we do that and I'll help you get right so that whatever it is that you aspire to do, whatever it is that you guys want out of life, you can get them, okay? Everybody doesn't want real estate um, or want to be involved in real estate, and I understand that, um, but this is just what I chose. I could have chosen anything else. I still can choose anything else, but this is just where I'm comfortable. This is where I'm happy. This is what I do for now. So um, until next time, I will try, like I said, to make the videos a little closer together um, but 
hopefully you see this. Hopefully you're inspired by this. Um, and until the next time I see you guys, do me a favor, share these videos, give me a thumbs up. If you have comments, leave them. Subscribe to the video. If you haven't already, if you've watched these and they helped you in any way, subscribe to the videos. I want to get my subscribers up. The more people I can help, the more people I can reach, the better. Um, until next time, I love you guys and I will be making more videos. I promise that on every video, but eventually I will. All right. Peace. I love y'all. Go get it. Keep getting it.